Hey, welcome to Live with Lynn. So if you're here, say hi. If you're watching the replay, be sure to type replay so I know you were here. I'm Lynn Huber, and I appreciate you being here today. So today I'm actually um, doing my live to ask you a favor, and I'm just asking, would you be willing to help me? You know, COVID-19 is hitting everyone hard. I don't have to tell you that, right? During this time of dislocation and fear and trauma, nonprofits are also struggling mightily. The pandemic and the economic collapse constitute an existential, an existential threat for nonprofits working to meet the needs of the people. So there's no guarantee that the public's going to receive services now or in the future, or that the staff members, you know, that the ones that face it, the heart of every organization are going to retain their jobs. Hi, Julie. Good to see you. So everything is uncertain. Everyone's on edge. And so if you've been following me for any length of time, you probably know that I'm a strong advocate for the American Cancer Society's Making Strides Against Breast Cancer. This really started because of my becoming an Avon representative 20 years ago, but Avon has been making a difference in the lives of women and the lives of those around them for more than 130 years. And since 1992, the Avon um, Breast Cancer Crusade has been at the forefront in the fight against breast cancer. Avon's contributed more than $800 million to breast cancer crusades. How's that? $800 million. They've educated millions of women around, about breast health. They've funded 20 million mammograms and, and clinical breast exams. In 2018, Avon partnered with the American Cancer Society, and I love that. I mean, seriously, when two big powerhouses like that come together, anything is possible. Hi, Anitra. Good to see you. So together, we can do so much more between Avon and the American Cancer Society together. And so every year, I work hard to raise as much money as possible for this amazing cause. In 2018, Richard and I raised about $8,000. Last year, we raised just over $10,000. Our goal this year was $15,000. And we got started early this year, and we were doing great. And then COVID struck. You know, COVID is putting a lot of a lot at risk right now, including the fight against breast cancer. But this is one fight we can't, that can't be canceled or postponed. I mean, women are being diagnosed with breast cancer every day. And COVID-19 is going to reduce the funding of cancer research by 50% in 2020 if the current trends continue. Wow. I mean, 50%. 1.4 million calls would go unanswered. Nearly 500,000 patients could go without a free ride or a place to stay while receiving treatment. And this, this is just what could be at stake just in one year alone. So this is like, this is so important right now. The future can be free from breast cancer and that future is in your hands right now. So my goal this year was $15,000, right? Luckily we got started early this year. And so far Richard and I have raised about $4,800. But as of March, when everything started shutting down, we haven't raised another penny since then. You know, all of our fundraising was done in event settings, and that's not possible any longer. We can't have groups of people together. And this is so important to me that I've decided to create an Avon fundraiser to try to raise as much as I can. I am going to give all of my commissions to the, to the fundraiser sales to the Making Strides Against Breast Cancer, all of them. Um, the link is avon.com forward slash fundraiser forward slash MSABC Utah. Let me see. I think I can put that on the screen. There you go. So that MSABC is, a, is Making Strides Against Breast Cancer Utah, right? Um, so, and then let me see if I can add it in the comments too, so that it's there. Okay, that should also be in the comments. So, so maybe you want to help, but you can't afford it, right? I understand. COVID is hurting you too. We're all struggling, right? But wouldn't it be great if your normal beauty, personal care, and gift shopping could raise money to fight breast cancer? Well, there's nobody, you don't need to dream about that. Now it can. So these are products you're going to use anyway, right? I mean, seriously, have you seen the new Avon lately? You won't believe all the products that they have now. Of course, we have all the usual skincare and fragrance and jewelry items that we've always had, but now we have products to help keep you safe like face masks, hand sanitizer, cleansing wipes, and all kinds of things for safety. We even have the K Korean K94 masks, which are the same as the N95 masks that they use in the hospitals. Avon has cleaning supplies, 
um, such as dish soap and multi-purpose wipes and multi-purpose cleansers, hood and range cleaners, and even laundry detergent. In fact, our laundry detergent is amazing. Is amazing. It comes in sheets, and you just take the sheet and you throw it in the washer, kind of like those dryer sheets, you know. Except these are these are um, these are laundry detergent. You put them in the washer, and you just throw them in the washer. No mess or fuss. You know, you don't have to measure, you don't have to pour, you don't have to carry anything big. It's amazing. We have a whole new line of oral care from anything from lots and lots of different kinds of toothpaste and toothbrushes. We even have teeth whitening products. And we have a whole line of chi hair care products and even curling irons and flat irons and, and hair dryers and everything you need to make your hair look amazing. And believe it or not, we even have some food items. We have some instant ramen noodles directly from Korea, which are so much better than what you get at the store. And we have cooked rice too. So I'm just, I'm not asking you to make a donation. I mean, of course, if you want to, I'll be happy to give you the donation link. Just private message me for it. But what I'm asking is if you just purchase your everyday shopping and beauty and personal care and gifts from my fundraiser, I will give all of my earnings towards this amazing cause. So I'm not looking to make any money from this. You know, um, I'm going to give it all towards making strides. I just feel like this crazy pandemic has already hurt us in so many ways. Let's not let it stop women from getting the help they desperately need. Can you even imagine having to deal with COVID and cancer at the same time? Oh, my gosh. Anitra says, I personally would like cancer to all go away. Yeah, no kidding, huh? Yeah. So are you in? So, hey, please like and share this video. Let's get as many eyes as possible on it. We can do this together. And with your help, I know we can make a difference. So that's what I have for you today. Thank you for being here with me. Thank you, Julie and Anitra, for being live with me. And anyone else who might be live who just didn't comment, and anyone who's watching the replay, I appreciate you. So go out there and have an amazing day, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.